In this video, we will consider bioinformatics and big data. Everyone is talking about big data these days, and in biology, we have some pretty big data sets. Probably the most famous example is the Human Genome Project. Hundreds of scientists from across the world work together to determine the DNA sequence of the entire human genome. The first complete map of the human genome was published in Nature in 2001. The results are stored in the GeneBank data bank in the USA, an ensemble data bank in Europe. The data are freely available to everyone at no cost. Since then, the genomes of a wide variety of animals and plants have been reported. Scientists freely share the results with each other by depositing their data in public biological databases. Here are just a few of the most popular databases. This information is very valuable to research scientists. However, having data stored in so many different places, and often with different file formats, does make life complicated. Also, if you've ever opened one of these files, then you will be aware that these data-rich files are not easy for humans to read. To help scientists get the most out of their results, we need bioinformatic tools to view and analyse our data. Essentially, bioinformatic software such as JalView can do the heavy lifting. JalView is sometimes described as a computational workbench. The JalView desktop is the workbench. The databases contain the raw material that can be loaded into JalView. Then JalView supplies the tools to help the scientists analyse and understand their data.